everyone and welcome back to another video. Today we are going to celebrate Peanut's birthday. So, let's just hop straight into it. Oh, look at her! Look at that dress! God, I wish she was a Velma. <laughs> Out of everyone on this island, Velma. <sighs> okay, we're not gonna let her ruin our moment. It's, it's Peanut's day, and she's happy that's not ruined it. I love having folks come over to hang out and have fun. Aww. Oh my god, look at Velma. She wrapped it up at everything. It's so awesome. I wonder what's inside. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> uh, I guess we'll talk to her. Yeah, it would look fabulous if he wasn't here. Okay, is that too mean? I feel like I'm being too mean. I just, uh, she's not supposed to be here. But we're going to celebrate anyway because it's all about peanut. So, yeah, let's take a bunch of pictures of her. So, I didn't get none of the birthday items. I didn't play one of those with me. Um... Maybe I'll explain why in a later video, but yeah. I wish you would like some more. Oh, oh, wrong button. Peter, can you come over here? There we go. So precious, look at her. Oh, so precious. <laughs> Give me a little hat. I told you we could not live without sweets. I need a birthday cake now. <laughs> oh, it's so precious. Like, oh my god. I love this so much. I love birthdays. I think they're so cute, even though there's really nothing to it. But it's just, it's so precious to see them so happy. You know, it is kind of sad. I don't really think I'm going to keep Peanut, though. But she is the only Pippi right now, so she's staying for now. But, I don't know. I love her so much, it's probably, I, I don't know, it's gonna be hard to let her go. But yeah. Uh, okay, Velma's kinda cute right here, kind of. Kind of, it's the key word here, people. But yeah, that's pretty much it. <laughs> Let's talk to her again. <laughs> Part <-tay. laughs> Oh my god, this is so cute. Oh, so cute. Oh my god. I never noticed that. The candles go out. Well, alright then. <laughs> my peanut, I hope you continue to enjoy your day. And I'll see you later. <laughs> Heading home. <laughs> the present. All these butterflies in this warmer area. Like, what is going on?
Now I think would be a good time to give a little, I guess, mini tour on my island. Talk about the future of the channel and little things like that. I think would be nice, so. Yeah, we have another one I wish to leave, but you know what, we're not going to focus on that right now. We're just going to focus on the little tour. So, I guess we just begin. <laughs> Now, this little beach area, I do have plans for. I might move, fix this little area. I kind of want to move an islander here. I'm not exactly sure. If not, I would do it on the other side. Um, as you can see, I kind of made a little waterfall here for the entrance and stuff. My entrance isn't done. Um, I still gotta curve a lot of the sides down, switch a lot of stuff around. Um, this will be like I said, I can show what you think right now. Um, yeah, this is it. I basically kind of, not copy, but replicated as best as I could of my second island. Um, it was originally looking like this. Um, I have many pictures. I'll might post a picture up over here, but it's not as long as it's supposed to have. So, yeah. That's what it looks like. I love it so much. But, what I do miss is more of the natural look. So that's what I think I'm going to go for. I think I'm going to take a lot of the stone off and put more of like natural paths down. Um, change these out, change the street lamp or more like the tall lanterns. Um, I really love those. I don't have the DIY for that just yet though. So we'll see. Um, uh, taking another little stroll around the desert. And you see I have like I have a bunch of trees. I love the trees so I do have a ton around here. That's why I say I kinda wanna go back to the natural look of things. Um, and if I do, I of course have to change my trees around to make it more natural. I don't know. I really do like this little fight though. So, I don't know. It's a big I don't know. I'm very happy with it. Like, I love it. It's very beautiful. But, yeah. We have some two islanders back here. Now, all this is definitely going to change. Because coming over here, I definitely want to move my crescent moon like down some so I can <laughs> so I can build this part back out. This part is gonna be where my castle is. Um, I also made a castle in my second one. I'll if I don't post a clip of it like right now, again that's on my Instagram as well. Just you know. <laughs> Check that out and follow the promo. <laughs> so, but yeah, that's my leg. Um, I'm gonna push it down just a little bit more. I already know how I want this to be planned out. So, um, also back here, the original plan was gonna have like a forest back here, but I actually have an idea for that. And I'm actually gonna move this to a completely different area. This is my great fairy tree. Um, yeah, I do have a, a speed build of it if you're interested. So, yeah, it's very cute. Like, I have, I have everything pretty much planned out in my head. It's just a lot of redecorating, moving things around, which I don't mind. Um, I just like to take my time with stuff and just have fun. So, yeah. Um, back here, I just have like extra fruit trees and stuff like that. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna give too much of what I'm actually gonna do until I actually do it. But yeah, I haven't done. <laughs> look at the beach. I haven't done anything up over there just yet. That's more of like storage where I keep like a bunch of cedar trees and stuff like that at. So yeah, I'm gonna have my house over there. Oh, I don't have my ladder on me. But <laughs> up there is a little neighborhood. 
I can show you the map while I'm at it. So this is what it looks like right now. And yeah, a lot of changes is gonna come for the future. So um, these are the villagers I have. The only one I know for sure are gonna stay is Julian. He's my number one. I love him. Um, Dobia is staying and Claudia. They have permanent spots on the island. Um, another villager that I want that will have a permanent spot on the island will be Stitches. Stitches is my second favorite um, villager ever, so I definitely have to get him on here. So, yeah. Pico, I really love, but I can probably let go of. I do want one of the Sanrio characters, so I might actually replace somebody with her. And Bertha as well. I love Bertha. I came to love her. But she's going to be going soon. Sure, but I'm not going to keep. I'm actually going to replace him with Marshall. Since his house is in the spot where I pictured Marshall would be. His house um, is where I pictured Marshall would be, so... Whenever he decides he wants to leave, I'll let him go and I'll hunt for Marshall. And yeah, she's going to leave. I'm going to have to go replace her with Agnes. Um, I think she's pretty cute. I think she'll fit the island pretty well. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I still got a lot to do work here. Oh, this is the main part. Um, not the beach though. But these cliffs, I really like. I think they came out beautiful. But when I redid the shop area, I moved the shops over a little bit. And as you can see, the roads don't line up anymore and it, it looks tacky. So I'm going to take all the cliffs down, rework this whole area. Um. What I kind of want to do right here, I really do, I love this little spot, but I think I'm going to make it longer. Like, make it come out this way, maybe? I'm not sure just yet. Because I really do love it. I'm just not exactly sure how I want it. Yeah. This is my little mush beach down here. I also have a speed build of that. On the channel, so if you want to check that out, go right ahead. I have a speed build of like just little area too, but again, all that's gonna change. So yeah, but this part I really love. I don't see myself changing it. I just have to finish working on it. So, but yeah, I'm gonna go so big again. Oh, I took like a million pictures of him. Over here is where I put all the extra houses to like um, work on it. I okay. I know where I want everybody to be. It's just I just have to work on the area. So um, yeah. So they all just right here for now. I kind of need to move them though if I want to work on like my forest area. But for now, they're perfectly fine where they're at, so. Okay, I'm back. I have water, and I'm good to go. <laughs> and here's the museum back here. Still looking old and pathetic. Red finally came to my island the other day, and I'm just like, finally. Finally. And I gotta give that penny to him so we can upgrade that, but not worrying about that anytime soon. I threw the campsite down here just because it's in the way. But I do have a, a plan on where I want to put that. I'm going to keep it on the beach. I'm just going to move it somewhere else. But yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't know. That's pretty oh my god. I don't have a... Of course I don't have a... <laughs> so yeah. Um, this was just a little video celebrating Peanut and another little update for the YouTube channel. I want to 
show my resin craft. I just recently started my first batch of resin. I actually did an Animal Crossing game, of course. Oh my god, look at those. <laughs> and they came out pretty well. There's a lot of it, um, room for improvement, of course. Um, I'll flash a picture here. If not, a kid, I just posted that today on my Instagram, so definitely check that out. I started my second batch this evening, so hopefully tomorrow they come out even better. And then, yeah. So I would love to do videos in the future of me, like, making crowds and stuff like that. I also purchased a little notebook and I bought some stickers as well so I kind of want to do a YouTube journal kind of thing to like um to like track my progress and just just more of like a memory type of thing so um if you're interested in that definitely that will come as well so yeah that's pretty much it pretty much it for the video i just wanted to talk to you guys and let you know what's going on for the future and yeah so if you made it this far thank you thank you i hope you subscribe and check out other videos and yeah i see you in the next one bye